After 101 days of complicated, stress-induced, and unexpected campaigning, the last thing I thought to gain was courage and enlightenment. Nobody likes losing. If you're like me, the best way to learn anything is through osmosis, meaning that by watching and observing, I learn quicker than studying or asking questions. At first, I was hesitant in helping. Undeniably, the idea of joining a political campaign was already leading me towards a path of doubt and a niche on my head that led to a basic question. Why? Why get involved? Why this person? Why now? Knowing nothing about Juan Guevara, I reached out to him to have a chat. After he shared his point of view and some of his principles, I quickly got a good grasp of this person and what he held in high regard. What I like most is that I felt like Juan seemed like he looked around and saw no other option but to put his best foot forward and run for Sheriff Coroner of San Benito County. An admirable trait, most certainly. You see, Juan from a young age overcame obstacles, negativity, and challenges not many would know about or would care to consider. I could only say that for those in similar situations, they could relate the most. He and his siblings were raised by a single mother on Section 8 housing. Needless to say, when you're a product of this environment, you see and experience life in an uncurated way. Despite the odds, he graduated with his Bachelor's of Science degree. Less than 42% of officers have at least a bachelor's degree, yet his dream of being an educated police officer did not deter him. Suddenly, and without pointing to an exact moment, I said to myself, I resonate with this person. So we hit the ground running. I saw Juan's desire to get better and better as the days went on. Event after event, he continued to discuss issues and adjust his rhetoric. There was a unique cadence that was starting to develop, raising issues like the need for more women on patrol, a need for community engagement, and a desire to improve the quality of life in San Benito County for everyone. Admittedly, I felt guilty because I wasn't aware of these issues until now. Ultimately, after a long-fought campaign and leaving it all out on the field with no regrets, the votes did not sway to Juan's favor. A democracy is a government run by the people. Each citizen has a say or a vote in how the government is run, and I totally appreciate and value and respect the system. The right to an opinion and to vote should be universal, and unfortunately, there are some places in the world where doing so brings on consequences. I am truly grateful. I am also proud and happy of all the successes and failures that came along the way with this campaign. In the end, everyone gets what they want. What we did is run knowingly against the odds. We gain hope from many voters and knowing there's a better tomorrow on the horizon because of our efforts truly excites me.